In my hand, I hold the results of a clinical study that looks at the efficacy of U-shaped automatic electric toothbrushes. The results are pretty damning and give us reason to be concerned. But despite this, I still remain optimistic for the future of this type of toothbrush. So U-shaped toothbrushes, also known as mouthpiece or automatic toothbrushes, are a new type of dental healthcare appliance designed to be a potential replacement to the manual and electric toothbrushes that we more commonly use. To date, there have been no clinical studies into these products, but the University of Florence have undertaken a study published in June 2020 in the International Journal of Environmental Research and Public Health that demonstrates that these products are not effective in cleaning our teeth. The study looked at how effective a U-shaped toothbrush was at removing plaque from the teeth in comparison to a powered toothbrush, no brushing at all, and habitual brushing techniques that the participants had. Now the mouthpiece style toothbrush they used in the study was this, this is V-White. Now there are a whole number of different mouthpiece or U-shaped style toothbrushes available, but V-White is one of the most prevalent. It's been the most heavily promoted, it's probably one of the most cost effective and one of the easiest to get hold of. So I must stress, although this study is talking about the efficacy of U-shaped toothbrushes, they did only test one product. So not all products of this type are necessarily created equal, but being the most popular or one of the most popular, it made sense for this product to be included. Now my own hands-on review of this product was not positive. I found that it cleaned the teeth terribly and this study has backed those findings up. The results of the study indicated that the use of V-Wipe was no more effective than no brushing at all. Yes, you heard that right. Using V-Wipe was no more effective than not brushing your teeth at all. Basically, the study found that you might as well not brush your teeth than use V-Wipe. Now, the researchers did state that one of the reasons why V-Wipe was probably not effective was because in many places, the bristles didn't make contact with the teeth or the gum line in the way that you would expect it to. And that's exactly what I found with my hands-on testing. But to come to the conclusion that it's essentially as effective as no brushing at all is pretty damning and something we should be worried about when these products are being so widely promoted, not only to adults, but to young children as well. Using these could pose a real risk to your oral health and the research of this clinical study concludes that they cannot recommend this product as something you use to clean your teeth with. Now to be fair to the study and to VY and other products of this type, the study was only small with 22 participants but it's better than no study at all. It was carried out under typical clinical conditions and it's the best that we can ask for uh, so far. In time, I'm sure more studies will become available and show more details about how these products can be more effective. And my own hands-on testing, not clinical studies, has revealed that there are different types of U-shaped toothbrushes that could be more effective. V-White specifically has silicone bristles, I've already tested a couple of products that have nylon bristles and I feel that they are incredibly more effective. There's certainly a increasing wave of these type of products and with time, these products will improve. I'm very optimistic about this. I do feel that these products, when developed correctly, can improve the standards of our oral healthcare. Many of us are not brushing for the right amount of time or with the correct technique. And these can certainly aid us in that process, but they're only any good if they do actually work more effectively than the tools and procedures that we have now. So this is very damning and this is an endorsement not to buy v White and be very wary of any other product of this type until such time as there is more data and analysis on these products to really confirm that they do work effectively and can be a potential alternative uh, to the current tools that we have. Now, a quick point to add in with this study is that Obviously, it was all randomized, as you would expect of such a clinical study, but they actually had participants use V-White for the more typical two minute brushing time that we would associate with brushing our teeth. Now, V-White out of the box is designed to run for just 45 seconds. So the results of this study are actually based on using V-White for considerably longer uh, 
in fact, twice as long as you are recommended by the manufacturer. And yet, despite using it for over twice the recommended usage time, the results were still as poor as the study has indicated. So that's something to be aware of in the study. They, they went to even greater lengths to try and essentially make this work uh, effectively and, and be a fair study in many regards. But yet it still proved ineffective. So there you have it. There's the study uh, and the results that they have. I'll link the study in the description below. If you want more uh, videos like this, please do click subscribe. If you found this video useful, be sure to give it a thumbs up. But until next time, thanks for watching.